Well, coaching has been the forefront of my career for the last 15 years. Before that, I played for about 10 or 12 years on the PGA Tour and all over the world, and got, playing was the most important thing to me then. Well, now it's coaching, but I still have played over the years and had some success. I played in uh, 12 major championships and uh, was a full-time member of the PGA Tour, and I've had success in the PGA Club Pro, PGA Professional Arena nationally and internationally. And, um, I've had some success. It's been a good. It's been a good mix. I think playing helps my coaching. And I think coaching helps my playing. However, the older I'm getting, my playing is starting to suffer a little bit, which is bothering me internally. That I need to figure this out. But uh, um, I think they work hand in hand. I think they benefit off each other. They piggyback off each other because I think if you can play and understand the game, I think the kids can grab a hold of that, and they they like that. It commands a little more respect. Um, and playing wise, you know, I I think the success of our program has taken me away from the playing side mentally as much, probably more than it has in the past. And it's harder to play because of the, the needs and the, the time requirements for the, for the position and what our team has done in the last seven, eight, nine years. So I'm trying to find, fight that battle internally and try to find time to do both. But playing golf is important to me. It's important to the position. Playing bad golf is not important to me. And that's something that bothers me that I'm trying to get over right now. But uh, we'll get it straightened out and figured out.